Well, now to a heartwarming moment in La Jolla this morning as a family from Utah is reunited, reunited with their stolen dog. Uh, our very own photojournalist David Pradell has that story. That's really good. We're so we're, happy. We're, excited. Yeah, we're, we're so happy. happy. We're so grateful. We're yeah. so grateful. We feel very lucky. The Grillo's family beloved mini golden doodle, Chancho, was stolen from his crate while vacationing at Camp Land on the Bay earlier this month. We tried to, you know, stay as long as we could looking for him, putting out flyers, but, you know, unfortunately we did have to go home. And that drive home was so hard just knowing that we were missing a member of our family. I I was just wondering what happened to him. I, I was really worried. I was really worried that he got hurt or something. According to Lieutenant Adam Sharkey, after reviewing hours of footage and receiving multiple tips from the community, detectives found Chan Cho in National City Thursday afternoon and arrested 40-year-old Johnny Smith, who was booked on felony theft charges. Yesterday when they called us and let us know that they had they had our dog, it was very exciting, a very exciting moment. Happy that we're going to get to take our dog back to Utah again and um, happy that we know that he's okay because that was the biggest worry. Chancho is now safe and back in the arms of his family. I feel like grateful to the community especially and to the officers for being so responsive to listening to everything we had to say and, and for working with us and being really diligent and communicating with us. And could you tell me uh, the type of dog Chancho is? Do you mind, like, what, what does he like to do? What does he like to eat? What does he like to do for fun? It's a golden doodle. He loves new foods <laughs> and, and he likes to play with us all the time. He'll, he likes to play hide-and-seek, hide huh, Liam? Yeah, yeah he <laughs> so, loves hide-and-seek. Yeah. How are you doing? What are you doing? What a beautiful morning it was to see the reunion and seeing Liam be reunited with Chancho. And now they're on their way back to Utah. If you want to follow along the family's journey with their dog, they created an Instagram account at Chancho the Golden Doodle. I'm David Burdell for KUSI News. Oh, David, David Prudell. Yeah. My goodness, so, on-air debut. Uh, for people at home, they, they don't you know, know, but David is a photographer here, he very is. talented, and I think that's the first time I saw him. Well, and I've noticed when he does stories, he usually puts himself into the yeah. stories somehow, whether yeah. it just be, you know, whatever, if it's yeah. interactive. So it's so cool to see him doing the reporting um, thing. But also that reunion, my goodness. Losing oh my a gosh. pet. I once... <laughs> This is a sore spot. and eh, we broke up anyway. But I once lost my ex's cat. That's not mm. why we broke up. But the the just the terrifying feeling you have of losing an animal, even oh, for know. a little bit. Oh, I mean, even if I leave the door open for half a second, I need right. to go find my cat and yeah. make sure that it's still in the house. You need to you see know them I mean? at all yeah. times. So I'm yeah, glad exactly. that that ended well. No kidding. Francella Perez joining us now. <laughs> Boy. A good ending. Oh, my gosh. I'm blown away by David Perdell. I know. I'm so, so good. I'm so happy to see him do that piece. He did an mm -hmm. excellent job. My gosh. He seemed to be sweating just a little bit yeah. out there. Oh, though. yeah. Yeah. You know, maybe think, it was nerves. Maybe it was the weather. Who knows? Probably just the weather because it is it has been very muggy and has been very hot. And we've all been sweating. Uh, definitely. Uh, it's just been that streak of very muggy conditions because of monsoon moisture.